Hello, my name is Lydia and this is The No. Rishi Sunak has ruled out an election for May 2nd. Putin has urged Russians to vote in the upcoming general election. And James Heapy has announced he will be stepping down as MP. Keep watching to find out more. Rishi Sunak has ruled out a general election for May 2nd, suggesting it could happen towards the second half of the year. When asked about a May election, he said... In several weeks' time, we've got elections for police and crime commissioners, for local councils, for mayors across the country. There won't be a general election on that day, but when there is a general election, what matters is the choice. A general election takes place every five years unless a prime minister holds one earlier. The latest an election could currently take place is the 28th of January 2025. Opposition parties have been pushing for Sunak to call an election, with Labour's election coordinator, Pak Mufadden, saying, After 14 years of Tory failure, the British public have the right to expect an election. Meanwhile, in Russia, Vladimir Putin has called on citizens to vote as polling stations open three days ahead of their presidential election. Unlike England, Russia holds an election every six years, and this will be Putin's fifth time standing for presidency. Ahead of the election, a television ad was rolled out to encourage Russians to vote. Standing alongside Putin in the election is Nikolai Karatinov, representing the Communist Party, Leonard Slutsky from the nationalist LDPR, and Vladislav Davinkov from New People. Putin has not taken part in any of the televised debates in the run-up to the election. And finally, James Heapy has announced he will be stepping down as an MP in the next election. Announcing the news on X, he explained it was a painful decision, but time to prioritise my family and pursue a new career. Heapy has been Minister of State for the Armed Forces since 2022 and is expected to leave his role next month. He currently serves as MP for Wales and Somerset. The news will be another blow for Rishi Sunak, who has already seen 59 other MPs standing down from their position. Thank you for watching The Know. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to The Mirror for more daily news updates.